Welcome back to LearnWire. It's been a while since I made a video about Tube Atlas, and today in my business, I needed to pull the software up to use it in order to create some video uh, ideas for some of my next videos that I'm going to create, even on LearnWire, right? So, of course, it's not going to, it's probably not going to, uh, tell us what softwares that we need to review. So those are always going to be a part of the channel, but some of the other videos that I like to create that are not necessarily a software review, I also need better ideas on how to do that. And this, I'm going to show you how you can use the power of Tube Atlas and chat, open AI chat GPT to uh, uh, help you create really good on point um, titles for your videos. So what I did over here with the Tube Atlas, you can actually get a copy of this. It's a lifetime deal. Um, this, this has been around for, um, I don't know how long, at least a couple of years. And you can actually get it right now. If you use Tube 20, you'll get $20 off right now at the time of recording this video. So all you have to do is click on this and it does work on Mac and it does work on PC. So um, I've had this uh, software for a couple of years now and he continues to update it. Um, it has 12 new features right over here. We can actually click on that. It's going to show you all the new things that you can do. It's just a ton of stuff that he continues to develop. It's some of the slickest um, desktop software that you'll find in 2023. You, you can basically scrape any data that you're looking for on YouTube. And then look at all these testimonies, these real testimonies, real proof of people that are just like, this is just insane software. So really cool stuff. Link will be below, but let me show you exactly how I just now use this. If you do go and purchase it, let me just show you, um, this is what you'll get a con congratulations that you just got the software. There'll be a couple onboarding uh, for how to install it on Mac and Windows. It's super, super easy. There's also help tutorials and so forth. This is from Dave Gwinden. Um, he has been developing software for like over a decade, um, possibly up to 20 years. I mean, he's really, really good at what he does. And um, once you log in, you'll just put in your email right here and then you literally get the link to download. See, I've got the downloads right here. They're continuing to update the software. And then look at this extra bonuses right here. Look, um, you get all these different bonus videos right here on how to use the software, um, different ways that you can take your business to the next level and so forth. So all you get like basically like a course right here um, as well. So what I did was I went over here into the software. So I'm going to pull the software up real quick. And then what I did was uh, there's all kinds of tools over here. Uh, there's just a, a, a ton of tools as well right here. <clears throat> but really, um, I just went in and you know what? I hadn't used the software in a while, um, but I knew I wanted to get um, basically scrape all my YouTube titles. I'm going to show you why I needed to do that. And this tool will do that for you. Um, but you can go over here and go to channels. And what I did was I typed in learn wire and I just pushed, pushed search and then it went out and it found this. So I'm going to go ahead and just push stop and we have our channel right over here you can even change the image size check that out um, very customizable really cool stuff and so we have learn wire we have our channel id so i'm actually going to right click that and then you have all these other boxes right here it's very intuitive uh, channels tool so you can actually analyze um, the videos from selected channel so you would just go you could go and check the social blade stats uh, for any channel you're looking for as well just by clicking right here um, and so forth. So we're going to click that. We need to select that right click and analyze this video. So it's going to pull up this right over here. And then what you can do is you can actually go and start the auto scroll and it's going to automatically start scrolling through the entire videos. And I have like 300 videos on the channel. And what it did was I'll go ahead and uh, make this bigger now. So it just scrolled through all of my channels or all my videos right here. Look, check this out. Really cool. Uh, 300 videos right here. It scraped all that content. It's like scrape box for YouTube. So we have all of the video IDs right here. Okay. And um, you have all kinds of options, all the buttons up here as well. But what we're, we're going to go ahead and do is you can add all these links by clicking over here, add links to videos tool. So right here, we can just add all these to the videos tool. So you just push this extract video links right there and then you go add links, add links to video tool for whatever reason um, it, cause I already did this process uh, before uh, the doing the video. So I'm gonna go ahead and push X on that. We're gonna come back over here. Then you would go to the videos section, right? And this is what it's gonna look like. So now you're gonna have all of those uh, video IDs are going to be inside over here on the left side and you're going to see these are this is my channel 
all of these right here can make this bigger see so we've got all of our thumbnails right here um, and we have all the titles and you actually have all the stats that you would be looking for on any channel that you want to dissect and get information from you can get their tags and just um, any links that they have in their description the amount of subscribers uh, how much money they make on each video different things like that super cool stuff um, but what I'm really interested in is the titles and I wanted to get a bunch of different titles. So I went up here and then I went and did the, let's see, file. And then I, you can save your project as well. So you can come back and pull this information up anytime you want and not have to go through the, you know, the scraping and extraction process. Um, and then what I did was I just went to save to CSV and then I went and opened this up right over here and you'll see this is what it's going to look like. So now I'm and I'm a data person, right? Um, for half my career, I uh, basically was an, an analyst and lived inside of Microsoft Excel with data. So I'm kind of a data junkie. And so I like, um, believe it or not, it's kind of funny. Um, you might laugh at people that actually enjoy looking at content like this. Um, it is a lot of content all at once, but once you understand um, that you can easily find things, you can go up to the top up here and put bold on the headers. And if you want to look at something, you can make it bigger right here. You could also wrap the text if you wanted to. Uh, but what I'm mostly interested in, you'll see right here is, is the titles. And there are, if you highlight over column F, you'll see down here that there's 291 videos right there. Um, obviously, I don't want to feed that all into ChatGPT, so I'm going to pick about 100 of them, right? So I picked 100 of them, and I colored them in blue. You'll see I came all the way down into here, um, and I just basically copied all the... Um, I took about 100 of them, basically. So I actually went down here, and you'll see I went to about 100 right here, and I just copied these titles right here. And then what did I do next? I exited out of the software and then I went over to chat GPT over here and then I'll show you the prompt. So here's what I did. I said, please give uh, new video ideas, not exactly. Um, oh, okay. So we'll come all the way up and this is how you kind of talk to chat GPT to get um, the, you know, the right information that you're looking for. So I actually said this, I said, uh, I'm going to paste a bunch of actual video titles from my YouTube channel. What I want you to do is analyze the list and come up with 50 of the next logical, viral, catchy video topic titles for my YouTube, uh, for my channel based on this data. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Give me the title, the topics, blah, blah, blah. So then they started going after this and then they kind of, um, ChatGPT um, actually kind of didn't really go in the direction that I wanted them to. And I'm using model GPT-4. It should be very intelligent. Um, but it really just, you know, did agility writer. Uh, those were my last two videos. I, I don't really want to make these videos again. Um, it was rewriting the same videos, but it's basically, it was just basically going down the list and rewriting all my, my titles. And that is not what I was looking for. So I didn't really like that. So then what I ended up doing is I said, um, so then, um, I pasted, I pasted all that in and then, um, here's where, uh, based on the video titles, they actually started doing this and then it was still staying on point. It was, uh, I mean, it was still basically doing, um, all of the same kind of titles and that's not quite what I was looking for. Right. So then I said, please give me new video ideas, not exactly the same as the list, but new cutting edge titles for a channel that focuses on SEO and AI content software reviews and show tutorials on how to build niche websites and rank them with SEO. So then they got it right this time, a chat GBT. Here are 50 new cutting edge video titles for your channel, focusing on SEO, blah, blah, blah. And then now look, mastering SEO with AI, the ultimate guide, uh, the top 10 AI content tools for skyrocketing SEO, how to build a high performing niche website from scratch, SEO secrets, um, and et cetera, et cetera. So you can see all these different titles that I can actually go out and use. Um, for some of my next video ideas. Now, of course, I still have to come up with the content and some of these are not going to be easy to make videos for, but um, I, I know I can do it. And so um, then I said, now pick um, the first 10 that you think would have the most uh, subscribers and interest and impact. And so it actually did give me these. And this kind of tells you how AI works. It does prioritize the best content because when I copy and pasted the 48 that it gave me, and I pasted it into, um, I pasted it over here into another um, sheet. And I also did a highlight on it. And it was actually the first 10 
So these 10 right here is what it gave me. And these are the first 10 that was listed on the list, right? So that is the order that they, that ChatGPT and that they also, uh, ChatGPT also thinks that those are the best ones as well. So that is just a really cool way that you can use multiple tools to, um, we fed it a lot of uh, information, you know, all this information right here. And hopefully it used that in, to an extent to come up with the top the topic ideas um and of course you could come in here and just say you have a youtube channel about this give me the next topic ideas whatever and it probably would do just fine i've done that before um, but with this strategy we actually took all the titles and um, had it write um, some specific titles based on that information so uh, this is tube atlas really really cool there's other ways that you can use the software as well you can go over to just keywords and just say um let's say how to use AI for SEO, um, something like that. I'm just going to say generate. It's going to go out there and start finding keywords for us. Um, we can also go over here and just say, you can say how to make money on YouTube, push generate right there. And you can see there's going to be a lot more um, content for that particular keyword. You're going to have a lot of different keywords that are going to come out. We have our seed keyword over here, and then it's going to work as like an auto suggest feature over here. You can see what it's putting in and it's going to find all the ones that are like for um, how to make money on YouTube a, and then it's going to go to B uh, and so forth. So it's going to play the alphabet soup game and it's going to find you a, just uh, a, a million different keywords that you can, um, that you can go out and then you can go and analyze these and so forth. So these are going to be things that are actually being searched uh, into uh, the YouTube search bars over here. You can say SEO, and then we've got all the different ones that for SEO coming in right here. So there's going to be a ton of SEO stuff right here, et cetera, et cetera. So um, that's a keyword tool for YouTube as well. Then you can look at trends as well. I'm just going to type in chat GPT right there and past 30 days. Um, you can actually go 90 days, 12 months, but let's just see what's popular in the last 30 days. You can sort it um, by category. Uh, you can go YouTube search. You can actually do Google shopping, um, news, image, web, but I'll keep it on YouTube and we'll push go. And it's going to go out there and use chat GPT. And then we're going to find some different trending. Um, we're going to see this trending list right here for chat GPT. You can actually pull up this chart right here. It's going to tell you how popular it was or popular it is right here. So it's got all kinds of graphical uh, information right here. You can view this on uh, Google trends as well by clicking the Google trends button right there. It'll take you right over and it's already loaded and you can see it um, and see if there's any other um, related queries. So we have some breakout keywords right here. Um, Fla Flappy bird, Furby, chat GPT, um, auto GPT. Um, we can start using seeing if we can find some trends that um you know people aren't really making content on and so forth so really really cool ways to use uh tube atlas uh to help grow a youtube channel you could also use this for keyword research and you can actually use the keywords that you're finding in here to create um seo and blog content for as well so if you want to go pick up tube atlas remember they do have a 20 uh, discount code right here tube 20 Put that in the description below and remember to like subscribe and comment if you want to be in the running uh, for the giveaway that i'm doing this week um, on copify version 2 uh, you can get a copy of that if you win i'll be doing the drawing on monday all right we'll see you in the next video